were uh, trying things that had never been done. You had a lot of guys who were kind of peaking at the same time. Uh, guys who'd been around and been doing promos were kind of hitting their stride simultaneously. Uh, and, uh, you know, we were always trying to top, <laughs> try, try to top each other and push the envelope a little farther. Uh, at a certain point, you can't, you can't do that anymore. You know, if you imagine if they can that continue that path, the show would be, uh, unrecognizable, so I'm glad they uh, stepped back and decided to go uh, PG, and then every once in a while when they bring in a little harder uh, hitting element, it uh, it really connects. Do you think uh, with the changes that have been made, though, um, do you think some stars like Stone Cold or The Rock would have been able to break out you know, with having scripted promos and things like that? Yeah, because I think it's like you know baseball, where people say, "Well, could, uh, you know, the, the hitters of that era have competed with pitchers, you know, throwing harder and more variations." I think the best people would always find a way to uh, to uh, to survive and thrive. Um, so, I mean, nothing's for sure, but uh, you know, like you know, when Bruno, Bruno San Martino's name is thrown around. It's, yeah, he you know he knew how to connect. He knew how to get over with an audience and. Uh, he would have, uh, yeah. He would have. He would have. He would have been just fine.